Hey guys, Amanda here and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to show you five hacks that you can use for small bags. So for my first hack, I don't know about you guys, but I tend to need to take pills with me, whether it's ibuprofen or Tylenol or even my daily medication. So instead of lugging that around, I take a contact lens case. You can use other things. This just happens to be what I have laying around because I don't have pill cases, but you can see they fit in there very nicely. It's small and ba bam like there's nothing in there. So for my second hack, this is a company that I use. Basically they take designer brands of perfume and they make them into travel size bottles. As many of you know, perfumes can run a couple hundred dollars depending on what brand that you are using. And many of you don't want to spend the money to buy that unless you really like it. So why don't you kind of take it for a test drive first? So by using this company, you get to choose from, I think it's over 450 different kinds of perfumes. There's like a lot of them on there. And I went through and I picked about three of them. I have three here that I got. Uh, one of them is Prada, the other one is Versace, and the third one that I got is Dolce & Gabbana. So I'm gonna show you what these look like. They come in these cute little velvet bags. And whenever you twist them, they come up and you just spray. You can also just get them replaced so that way you just pop it off and then they send you the refill and you put it back in. And if you don't like it, you can always switch to a different scent. With mine, the tubes have come in different colors. So I have a blue one, I have a pink one, and right here I have a white one. The only thing that I've noticed with this company is that I can't tell which one is the scent that I ordered. Um, so you kind of just have to smell it and see which one is which. But on the plus side, the shipping's free and the little cases are interchangeable. Right here, I have three of them, but on their website you will see that they will give you one per month. So for my third hack, I have my beauty blender. This one isn't really necessarily just for small bags, it actually is for any bag. And the downside with my beauty blender is I don't clean it as much as I should. I know I should probably clean it after like several uses or every use, but I just don't. And I don't really have anything to put it in because it comes in a plastic container. So what I use is a little hefty baggie and all you got to do is unzip it put it in zip it up it's good to go and that way you don't get your purse dirty and your face doesn't get dirty by your beauty blender touching anything that might be dirty within your purse another hack that you can have for your beauty blender not to get the inner lining of your purse dirty is a little easter egg one of the ones you get for easter egg hunting you can stick it in there i haven't done that yet so i'm not sure if it fits exactly but from what i can see it looks like it'll fit just fine i don't have one laying around so that's why i don't use it but i know that is a trick that you can use if you have one so for my fourth hack, this is really simple. If you have baking powder laying around, you want to put baking powder into a bag and then you just put it in your purse and then it kind of eliminates any odors that you might have in your bag. This is also a hack that's meant for any bag. It doesn't necessarily have to be a small bag. So for my fifth and final hack, I have eyelashes. I know every girl has their eyelashes on. They can get irritating and you just want to rip them off and put them in your bag and not worried about them getting crumbled up. So instead of throwing them away so that way you can preserve them, I put them in a little container like so and then you're good to go and you can just put them right into your bag and even if you want to take new ones that you haven't worn and take them off and put them in there so that way you might have them for later or for the next morning if you're sleeping at somebody's house you have them thank you guys so much for watching my hacks i hope that you guys like them and it was informative and hopefully you guys will use some of them as well so just so you guys have all the information i'll have that below in the description also where you can go to get scent bird because that one isn't one that 
you might have laying around the house that's something that you actually go to their website so their website will be down there and I'll link you to that definitely make sure to go check out some of my other videos and please comment below to show me some love bye guys